Hello. Howdy. Oh, it's me. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Howdy. And welcome back to this episode of All Day Game Night on Talking with Kitties. Meow. She is girlfriend. He is boyfriend. And uh, we're going to play Would You Rather again because we had a lot of fun with it the last time. We did. Do you want to start? Sure. Would you rather have gorgeous fingernails for teeth or ivory tusks for fingers? Gorgeous. Gorgeous fingernails, fingernails for teeth. For teeth or ivory tusks. For phalanges. For fingernails. No, for fingers. Fingers. Oh, fingernails. Definitely fingernails for teeth. Gorgeous. Do stuff with my fangs. You do stuff with your fangs. Yes. So you would have gorgeous fingernails. Gorgeous fingernails you could, in my we teeth. We could paint your teeth. We could paint my teeth. We could paint my teeth now if you wanted. Okay. What would you do? Same? Yeah. Fingernails for teeth? For sure. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. fingernails for teeth. And I would like shape them differently each time I went to get them. You would do them pointy every time. I would probably bite them. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Save you a couple extra steps. It would. All right. Would you rather do yoga with flexibility and grace? I already do. But your mind is full of inner turmoil. Already happens. Or have serene inner peace, but the hips of a 12-year-old German shepherd. I want the hips of a 12-year-old German shepherd because let me tell you, I can already do yoga with grace, but my brain just can't calm itself. So you want the inner peace and the hip dysplasia? Yeah. Okay. I'm old. I'm going to be getting hip dysplasia soon anyway. So, yeah. yep. What would you pick? Um, that was a good one for me. I love yoga. Probably yoga. I'd probably do the yoga and inner turmoil. Really? At least that I'd be flexible. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We can make that happen. Okay. I don't, I mean. You can practice yoga with me. I don't, I don't want to just do yoga to be, I, I just want to. Oh, you have just want to have flexibility and grace. And grace. You and don't necessarily want to like, do it. I don't want to learn, learn it. Oh, okay, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. I just want to be there. Heaven forbid you have to practice. Oh, oh, pot calling kettle black there. I want to know how to play a musical instrument, but I don't want to learn. Next question. I just want to figure Next out. Next question. And know stuff. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm excited. Would you rather pee a little every time you see someone attractive? I already do. <laughs> I'm peeing right now. Or throw up in your mouth a little every time your date smiles. So we are you my basi- date? Yeah. So basically, and you you find me attractive, so you I'm, say I'm gonna pee. So are you gonna pee or throw up? Why Why are these always Why is pee always involved? I don't know. Why is there always pee? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna pee a little. Me too. And not just because of the card. I mean, from now on, <laughs> I'm just gonna pee a little every Great. time. Great. Like, do you pee a little the entire time? No, just a little. Just a little at first. You know, like an excited dog? Yeah. Yeah, you're just going to do like an excited piddle. Yeah, I do that already. Oh, my God. That's... You get home for... Why do you think it takes me a minute to get out whenever you come home from work? Because I'm peeing a little. All right, next question. This is not helping our relationship, by the way. Are you sure? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I feel like it's pretty helpful. Oh, good. Would you rather... This isn't even a question. Okay. Would you rather dispense postage stamps from your fingertip? Boy, I had a hard time getting that out. Yeah, okay, you did. let me try again. Let me try it again. Would you rather dispense postage stamps from your fingertips? Now, that's just really hard that's to say. That's practicing the p- 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 noise. Or fire nerf darts. I'm assuming also from your fingertips. Would you be really disappointed in me if I picked postage stamps? Yes. Okay. Then Nerf darts. (laughs) Would you really do postage stamps? No, I would do Nerf Nerf darts. darts. I just wanted to see what your reaction would be if I asked. Now, postage stamps would be helpful. I don't mail a lot. But we don't mail a whole lot anymore. Like back in the day when I like wrote letters to people and stuff, it would be super helpful. Yeah, but But that's not a thing. Now I write emails. Oh, oh, would you rather get eaten alive by mosquitoes, Ugh. or bleed to death by leeches. Probably leeches. Yep. Because you don't know they're on the on you until you see them, right? I, I don't know. I feel like that's how movies portray it. Yeah. I don't know if that's true. But I am really allergic to mosquito bites. And you get sure huge are. Welts. Yeah, you do. So not only would I be eaten alive and die, I would be itchy at the same time. And that would be the worst. Same. 
I don't want to. I don't want to itch to death. No, I would much rather just bring on the leeches. Yep, bring on the leeches. Bring on them leeches. Didn't they used to use leeches to yeah. heal certain diseases? Uh, yeah, certain things. Remember in um House of the Dragons, they kept leeching them for the. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That was like a real thing, leeching. No, I thought that they really did use leeches for stuff. I mean, they didn't actually leech the guy in no, House no, no. of Dragons. That was they an didn't? actor. <gasps> yeah. Patty Constantine. Constantine. They, they didn't, no, they didn't put leeches actually, on him? They didn't actually leech Patty Constantine. Oh. He was just acting. Acting. For those of you that can't tell, that's sarcasm. Because I did what? know that. What? <laughs> what? 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 Is your favorite color? <laughs> Isn't that the question they asked? That is okay. the question. Go me. Would you rather be able to use your fingers like scissors or your foot like a jackhammer? My leg would get tired, and I want to be Edward Scissor hands. I use scissors way more than I use jackhammers. That's true. I feel like a jackhammer foot. I don't know if a jackhammer foot would make drums more difficult or easier. You wouldn't need a double bass no, drum. You could do it yourself. But would you just go through the bass pedal? Probably. Oh, well, it doesn't say. Doesn't say it is a jackhammer. Well, okay, but if yeah, because you can't determine how fast a jackhammer goes correct i have no idea i'm pretty sure there isn't like modes to it like it's not like slow medium and fast i'm pretty sure it's just you turn it on and go but i don't know for sure i i do not have a lot of experience with jackhammers me either only a lot of experience with jackhammering that girl i was gonna say the only experience i have is getting jackhammered in the bedroom whoop, whoop. <laughs> sorry mom sorry mama <laughs> And on that classy note. Okay. Is it my turn? It is your turn. Would you rather be able to read every book in the world or listen to every piece of music in the world? Hmm. That's actually really hard. That is. But I mean, either way, you're going to deal with a lot of shitty something or other. True. So. True. Going to go with music. I feel like I could get more from music, even just the exposure to different types of Garbage. Uh, uh, genres. <laughs> Even shitty music, you know, we consider shitty music. Even shitty music has some good qualities. Pop's catchy as fuck. Pop is super catchy. Yeah. I, mean, I know you don't like it, but it's super catchy. Yeah, they design it's it to be. It's an earworm. Like, yeah. You claim you don't like Taylor Swift, but you hear a Taylor oh, that, Swift song. You, in can my head. Call, oh. you can call out that it's a Taylor Swift song, and then you're singing it for days. That's part of why I hate Taylor Swift so much. She gets stuck in there. Okay, how about we do this? How about we cheat the system? You're going to read all the books? Don't we listen to all the music with you? Yes. Okay. I'm going to read all the books, and then when I'm done reading, I'm going to hand you the book. No, just read them out loud to me between songs. Okay. Boom. Love it. Yes. Teamwork. Yay. Making the dream work, and the mm-hmm. dream is shitty books and shitty music. All books and all music. Yeah, but there's going to be a lot gotta of There's got to be ones. some good stuff in there. Oh, I'm sure there's got to be some good stuff. We're also going to have to dig through a pile of not great. True. But then we can we can cleanse our palate with Pantera. Opeth and Pantera. It's always Pantera. And Stephen King and Nicholas Sparks for me. I don't actually read his books much anymore. Pantera is always the palate cleanser. No. No, it always has been. It's not mine. I think mine's Fear Factory. That's a good one. What? Oh. 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 I don't like this question. <laughs> Would you rather produce a ripe banana from your butt once a day? Or spit up a plum every hour. How big is the plum? Uh, Big enough to be spit up. Banana in the butt once a day. I'm not yakking up any size plum once a, once an hour. Yeah, if it's only once a day. Yeah, once a day. It's just like a big and giant a poo. Potassium. Eat. No, 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 no. You are not eating that banana after it comes out of your butt. Why? They got a skin on them. You take it out, it's all sealed up, and you just rinse the skin off really good and then peel it. Wash your hands before you peel it. It'll be fine. You don't like chocolate covered bananas? Babe. There's always money in the banana stand. Do you remember a couple times ago when I said this is going to ruin our relationship or something to that effect? No, I don't recall that. Yeah, it's doing it. Just let me eat my poo banana and be happy. I want... Okay, wait. Waiting. I need you to take a second to hear what you just said. Let me eat my poo banana and be happy. Yeah. No, no, no. Let me say it to you. So you actually hear it coming out of someone's mouth. Let me eat my poo banana and be happy. Absolutely. You feel free to. 
on that disturbing note, this episode is over and we will never be playing this again oh, because I are no fun. have a disturbingly gross boyfriend. You are no fun at all. Not wanting banana. to eat a poo banana is it's no fun. It's not a little poo banana. You don't know. It doesn't say it to be. Right, it says it's right. Question. Would you rather only have 8% power on your phone or only have one eighth of a tank of gas? I'd rather only have an eighth of a tank of gas yeah, because I don't, don't go, go anywhere. anywhere. I got yeah. you. I knew. And we also listen to music on our phone, like when we're in the vehicle. How, is it inversely proportional? If you only have 8% on your phone, but you have a full tank of gas, you could just plug your phone into the car mm. and charge it. Oh. We screwed over the system again. Wah, wah. Would you rather replace the internet with brick and mortar libraries or... Replace television entertainment with stage plays. Stage plays. I knew you were Can I do plays. both? No. Please? That's a would you rather, not a would you like both. We've done that for half of them That's this time. That's different. Whenever you're... <laughs> whenever you're... whenever it makes you happy, girlfriend, absolutely not. Yes. Sorry, oh, Bubs. Sorry, sorry, Bubs. <laughs> we Go woke back him up. up on that one. Go oh, ahead. okay. He's one. better. Okay, he's good. Uh, stage okay. plays. Yeah, so you're going to do stage plays. Yeah, I'm going to do stage okay. plays. Sorry, Bubs. I'm going to do the same. I don't Shh. watch television or stage plays. Shh. He's sleeping. But I use the internet and I I, I love the idea of brick and mortar libraries, but there's, there's people there. Yeah. I don't like that. Yeah, you can use the safety of the safety of your home to get on the internet. Yeah, the safety of your home to get on the internet. And even if you, I mean, if you replace the entire internet with brick and mortar libraries, you're still going to lose like YouTube. Netflix. True. All that stuff. Because you're not going to be able to go to your local it library would be and get all the that. Live plays. That's the different thing. All right. All right. Would you rather only be able to speak in internet memes? I already do. Or always have it's a small world stuck in your head. Ha <laughs> mama. Well <laughs> that's fantastic. Mom's cringing currently. She sure is. Should I tell a story? Quick. It's a small world. Go ahead. It was it's a small world. I thought it was Green Acres. No. Well, that one also gets stuck in her. Have you never heard the It's a Small World story? No, I don't think so. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So my grandparents, my father's parents used to live in Orlando. When we would go to visit them, we would always go to Disney World. And I think, I'm not 100% sure if I was alive or if I was like just very young, like one or two. And my parents decided they were going to go on It's a Small World. So if I was alive, I was with my grandparents. If I wasn't, then obviously I wasn't there. Mom and Dirt decided to go on It's a Small World. And they got halfway through the ride and the ride broke down. And so they were sitting there and for like 45 minutes, it just played the song. They never turned it off. I've heard this story. So they played the song over and over and over again. And then all you could hear is tick, 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 Mm -hmm. tick, 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 tick. Tick, because the animatronic things were dan like all the dolls were dancing. Yeah. And side note, mom doesn't like dolls; they scare. Her. Well, they're terrifying, especially the animatronic ones. Especially the older yes. animatronics; they're all jerky. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, because then you heard the ticking. Of yeah, that would be jerky, terrifying. And it and the music played. So, this is mom's nightmare. Yeah, absolutely. I can see why. No, yeah, Green I've Acres. Heard that. Green Acres gets stuck in her head, but it's a small world. Is brings her gives yeah. her like PTSD. <laughs> I remember when I first found out about Green Acres, we were on the way down to the beach, and we were riding with your parents, and I saw Dunkin' Donuts, and I was just being dumb. I was like, Dunkin' Donuts is the place for me, and everybody just busted up laughing. And mom got really, like, Busted up laughing, and I was like, what? What is up, guys? I am not that funny. Like, you guys were ready to pee yourselves. And I was like, I do not understand why this is so funny. I don't know if it's true for everybody, but certain people always have one song stuck in their head. Like if they get a song stuck in their head, it's one single song. And that is my mom's one single song for like weeks. It'll be in her mind. It's going to be in her mind for the next week. So sorry, mama. You're this, welcome. I think in this title, it should be caution mama. <laughs> Cause that's two times we've apologized. You didn't pick though. Did you? I don't know. I don't even remember what the question was. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Tangents. Would you, Rather only be able to speak in internet memes or always have it's a small world stuff. Oh, in head. internet memes. I do it already. So, yeah, me too. I don't, but I would rather do that than have it's a small world stuck in my head. That's how I communicate. Though it's a small world would be better than some of the songs I get stuck in my head. True. Uh, would you rather swallow a live cockroach or eat your bedroom pillow? 
Can I use condiments? Sure. A cockroach is a whole lot smaller than my pillow. Yeah, I like my pillow. I don't like mine. Yeah, I like mine. But yeah, I'm going to eat the cockroach. Yeah, we're going to down that cockroach. But I'm going to like dip it in hot sauce. Mm. Hot, spicy, and wriggling. Now I'm thinking, do you ever, do you remember, you, you might be too young, do you remember Joe's apartment? Yes. Okay. Vaguely. That's, vaguely, Vaguely, yeah, same I remember here. it. I, I, re, I went back and rewatched it years later and it was terrible. I don't, I don't know that I've ever watched it, but I know oh, the man. premise of it. That's just the first thing that popped into my head was Joe's apartment and the cockroaches. I don't know why. Would you rather be the person who finds the cure for the common cold or be the person who gets rid of all internet trolls? Ooh. That's a really good one. I'm going to get rid of trolls. So I think I am too, only because there's so many other diseases out there. The common cold is it's not that big of a deal. And internet trolls would make everybody's life a little bit kinder. Is that considered like internet trolls? Are you also considering like cyber bullies? Yeah, I'm. I'm considering it all. To me, that's how I took it. I feel like to most people, the common cold. Well, yeah, I'm still. I'm gonna go with internet trolls. Yeah, I think that's a problem. People are so cruel. Internet trolls. Can we give all the internet trolls the common, the common cold? cold? Yes. yes. But like perpetual common yes. cold. They never get, they never recover. Yes. Oh. I'm excited. Oh. Oh. This is a good one for you. Okay. Would Do you know you, what my answer is going to be? I don't. Okay. That's why it's a good one for you. Would you rather, whenever you sit down, have your butt vibrate loudly but soothingly or receive an invisible back massage? That sounds like knuckles cracking. Oh. This is a good one for her because every time I crack my knuckles, she cringes. Of course, I have to crack my knuckles right Stop now because I'm thinking about it. Okay. So I'm going to go with the back massage that sounds like knuckles cracking because then I feel like I'll be able to associate knuckles cracking hey, with a yeah. back massage and it won't bother me as much. That's a that's good thinking. Yeah. No, I'm going to have a vibrating butt. That does not surprise me in the slightest yeah. that that's what you chose. Like, I'll sit down. <laughs> Does it happen the whole time you're sitting? I hope so. Oh, my God. That's what I'm signing up for. You know, all we need to do is get you a vibrator. <laughs> but that's not soothing. It might be. It's not soothing. It might be. You haven't it's tried it. It's not soothing. You should let I'm just going to go with no. It. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that button would come in handy. Would you rather always look perfectly put together when you run into your ex or always have a flattering driver's license photo? Driver's license photo. I would too. Yeah. I don't give a shit what I look like when I see my ex because my ex isn't worth my time. Yeah. Flattering. Flattering driver's license photo. 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 Oh, uh, would you rather have all of your thoughts projected in a hologram above your head? Oh. No. Or... Have a second mouth on your shoulder that constantly criticizes you. I have that going through my head anyway, so it would just be my... Other people could hear it. Yeah, but I pretty much say it out loud anyways because yeah. I have self-deprecating humor. So yes. I would rather it be this sh my shoulder friend says mean things about me than people... It would just be in your internal dialogue outside. Yeah. yeah. I have some things that people don't need to see in my brain hole. But he's going to be... Oh. Okay. No, because yeah, you yeah, just yeah, yeah. talk shit on me, but my brain yeah. hole has other things other than just yeah. mean stuff. I'm going to go with the shoulder mouth. I'm going to go with the shoulder mouth. I'm going to go mouth. with the shit talking shoulder mouth. Heck yeah. Boop, boop. Would you rather have your superpower be the ability to always find rock star parking? Do you know what rock star parking is? I'm not sure. Okay. So rock star parking is when you get like the best parking spot in like, so if you're like going to Walmart, you get like the first one right beside the door. That's what I was thinking. Okay. So Rockstar Parking, or to always find perfectly ripe avocados. Yeah, Rockstar Parking. What? Yeah, yeah, avocados suck. Although we could make a we can make a mint selling the avocados to hipsters. Oh my god, that's so true. Boom. Nope, I avocados. want ripe avocados. Yeah, that is very true. Not even hipsters. Most people like avocados. <gasps> no, because a lot of people like guacamole. Oh, uh, guacamole uh, is yeah. Like my parents love guacamole. Yeah, we'll go with avocados just to make Heck, money. Yeah, we'll make, make so them dollar, much dollar money. Bills. That's a really Good stinking mm -hmm. with your poo banana. My poo banana. Would you rather hunt Hannibal Lecter with Scooby Doo and the gang? <laughs> you, they wouldn't hunt. Or him. hunt Hannibal Lecter with Inspector Gadget? Do 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 do. Inspector Gadget. Do 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 do. Inspector Gadget. Inspector Gadget. You wouldn't want the Scooby Gang, so you could try to hit on Daphne. Mm -hmm. No. 
That was such a fucked up episode of Supernatural. It was so messed up. So messed up. Come on, Dean. Get your life right. <laughs> Would you rather always be photographed with the perfect lighting with your fly down? Is the, is the perfect lighting on my fly? Perfect lighting would be all of you is oh. just overcome with light. Or always be photographed in old-timey Western costumes. That one? That one for sure. Absolutely. With your fly down. It, 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 is my junk out and perfectly lit? But if we were in old-timey, would that mean that our butts would be up because we'd be Ooh. wearing chaps? No. Oh. Well, I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> would you rather... Become Prince's best friend in the afterlife or bring Prince back to life but never meet him. <gasps> oh, I'm really torn because I love Prince and I would love to be friends with him. But at the same time, do I like the world enough to bring him back and never meet him? I could be friends with him. What would you pick? I would bring him back to life but never meet him because most of the things I've seen or heard about him say that he's a dick. But I want his music back. I could change him. It's one of those people are not projects. It's one, those, <laughs> it's one of those separate the artist from the art things. I've never yeah. heard. I've always uh, only heard that he was a fucking. He's a weirdo and not he's a, nice. I haven't and, heard that he's not nice, but I've heard that he's very odd. Yes. So, all right, bring him back. I'd rather have his music. Than, yeah, yeah, bring him back. Would you rather be licked to death by a golden retriever puppies or? Be smothered to death by sweet-smelling newborn babies. Oh, puppies, 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 puppies. Same. I'm sorry, I didn't read ahead, so I, I couldn't warn you. Puppies. <laughs> Would you rather take a 14-hour Greyhound bus ride wearing a paper hospital gown? Ooh. Oh. Or... Take a four-hour flight wearing a KKK hat. <gasps> paper gown. Paper gown. Absolutely not yes, paper sir. gown. That's paper awful. Gown. Would you rather only be able to drink room temperature bitter coffee oh. or only be able to drink scalding hot tea that never cools down? Oh, you're going to be tea all day because that's just how you prefer it. Heck yeah. I'll probably do room temperature coffee because that's bitter what I do. Bitter coffee, though. That's what I do. Okay. Well, maybe not bitter, but still. Bitter, that's, yeah. yeah. No, hotter the better. I'm very extreme when it comes to stuff like that. Yes. You like your coffee like you like your bedroom. I hate my bedroom hot. That's why I have the fan on every night. I was talking sexy like. Oh. Hot. Sorry. Yes. Hot. Just like that. I like my women like I like my coffee with a spoon in them. Whoa. Would you rather build your own house by watching YouTube videos okay, or build your own business? Does that, it's like build your own business by watching YouTube videos? I don't know. I want to build my own business. I'm going to build a business and buy a house. Yeah. Boom shakalaka. Boom shakalaka. I mean, I probably could build a house by watching YouTube videos. It wouldn't be a good house, but if I started my own business... You could have if it a real was successful, good house. yeah, you could buy a house that has like right angles and <laughs> shit, and right? Floor that's somewhat level. <laughs> That'd be nice. It would be. Would you rather show up at the most important job interview of your life with a giant cold sore, or sleep through your alarm and totally miss the most important job of your life? That's dumb. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna do the Go cold with sore. a cold sore. People have cold sores. It's okay. One time years ago, when I was when I was down at my dad's house. We had a power outage. I had a job interview in the morning and we had a power outage and it reset the, the clocks. And my alarm didn't go off. His alarm didn't go off. And we slept way later than we normally do. And we both woke up late and we and rammed it. That, that would have been a terrible job. And it was kind of like a blessing that really I didn't wake up on time. Cause Did you show up? I showed up. Yeah, I absolutely showed up. I told the guy what happened and everything. But yeah, there's no way I was getting that job. But I showed up. At least you showed up. It's yeah. worse when people just don't show up at all. That was a sketchy job, though. Was it? Like we pulled in. Uh, You'll have to tell me after that's yeah, what it was. It was real sketchy. Would you rather be hated by your friends for your constant bragging or be hated by your coworkers for your constant brown nosing? Brown nosing. Yeah, fuck them coworkers. I don't care about coworkers. I don't care about you. I don't care about you. He's pointing at the cats. Because I am pointing at the cats. They're my coworkers currently. Would you rather... Tell a white supremacist to take his feet off the only open seat on a bus 
or tell your parents you have a venereal disease. I'll tell my parents I have a venereal disease. They won't say much about it. This is his humor. Yeah. Inappropriate dark humor is both my coping mechanism and my reason for being. I would tell my parents. They wouldn't care. No. They'd be like, hmm, that sucks. Better be careful with that. <laughs> your grandfather. <laughs> oh. So her grandfather told me this story <laughs> about their honeymoon. And they got up to the room <laughs> and her grandmother, this was this is like wedding night, right? Mm -hmm. just after their wedding, mm -hmm. they got up to the they got up to the honeymoon suite or whatever. And he saw her luggage and it had her initials on it. And her initials were VD. And he's like, I just got married and I already have a VD. <laughs> so that's the kind of sense of humor that your family has. So yeah, I'd absolutely tell them that I had one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He was so proud of himself. He was so proud of himself. I mean, he must have been because that was like 50 years later and oh, he was man. still he was telling still that telling joke. That joke. <laughs> and it wasn't even a joke because he literally did yeah. do it. Like, it's true. Her initials uh, were VD. Okay. VD. Would you rather live in the home of your dreams, but you'll always have house guests who play drums all night? Hi. So, you and Fat Man. Yeah. Or live in a one-bedroom shack, but no one ever visits you. That one. That one. That <laughs> one. That one. That one. Where do I sign? I would like that. Do I have? Is that the house that I have to build from YouTube videos? Yes. Sweet. I'm doing it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Girl. As soon as I saw it, I'm like, well, I already know this. And you? Um. Wait, I got something for this. That's not the one. Damn it. Hey. There you, go. you play drums all night. You don't sleep a night anyways. I don't. Yeah, I'll take the drums. Yeah. Plus, if they're down here, I can almost kind of nap. Kitties would not be happy. Yeah, well, they'll be fine. Would you rather know the spoilers to every TV show or movie before you watch them? I look them up. I know you do. Or... Always have to go to the bathroom during the most exciting scene in a TV show or movie. No pausing. I'll look it up. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with spoilers. I'm still going to watch it. Even if you know it's happening, you can still watch it happen. I've seen a lot of spoilers. Like, I've known a lot of spoilers and actually seeing it happen. It's like, oh, okay. I knew that was happening, but that's awesome. Yeah, it's still, it doesn't, I mean, yeah. it kind of sucks because you lose some of the, like. Yeah. Yeah, that wouldn't phase me. Would you rather meet your hero and they say something racist to you? Or run into your nemesis and you say something embarrassingly stupid to them. Do you have a nemesis? No, I have two. I don't remember their names. So I always refer to them as enemy. Oh, you have two? You know both of them. I know one. I worked with one of them and then you worked with the other one. Down at the sandwich shop. Oh. She was the original enemy. The one that rubbed your shoulders? No. I don't remember one down there being called enemy. The one with the mouse? The one with the mouse? I can't think of her name. She works out at Lowe's now. Remember, she was she was the original enemy. I don't remember her being the enemy. Oh, uh, you don't pay attention. Sorry. Yeah, she why was, was she enemy? I have no idea. I have no idea when this one was why this one was enemy. I just this one was enemy were. because you tried to give her a present and yes. she didn't take it. What was it? It was something dumb too. It was like a packet of ketchup or something. Yeah. Yeah. It was a, it was a cup of ranch. Yes. It was a cup of ranch. And she didn't take she it. She wouldn't take it. It sat there for like three days. She was enemy. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So your nemesis. So which do you pick? Uh, I'm going to say something dumb to my nemesis. To your nemesis? Yeah. Me too. I don't have a nemesis though. No. I say embarrassing stuff all the time. So. All the time. Whatever. You could do that. I could do that thing where you play it off. Be like, yeah, yeah. Because I'm crazy, man. You don't want to fuck with me. I'm crazy. I say <laughs> shit like that. You know? Yeah. There, there you go. Yeah. Because that always works so well. Mm -hmm. People are always real scared of that guy. You see those fights, right? Mm -hmm. You guys, are, oh yeah, man, I'm crazy. You don't want to mess with me. I'm crazy. Ah, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Would you rather sit through your aunt and uncle's tag team comedy speech yes. at your cousin's wedding? Yes. Or listen to your local congressperson rap? No. I want to listen to my aunt and uncle. Tag team comedy. They would be funny. Oh, yes, they would. Yes, I want to listen. I, I choose your aunt and uncle as yep. well. They'd be funny. They would be hilarious. Hi, Gizmo Duck. Gizzard curled up on my chest earlier to take a nap. It was so cute. But then she totally ditched me to walk across the couch and sleep on her new cat blanket. It's a blanket with cats on it. It's not like a specialty made blanket for cats. It is now. Well, now, yeah, that's true. It's a blanket with cats on it for cats. There's a cat blanket with cats on it. Yeah. Would you rather only be able to listen to Nickelback mm. for a year or... 
only be able to listen to raccoons mating for a year. Raccoons mating. Really? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Nickelback's not that bad. We're pretty bad. I'm going to listen to Nickelback. For a year. Yeah, that's and fine. Only Nickelback for a year. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, no, raccoons mating. I'm not going to, I don't want to listen to anything mating for a year. I don't even want to listen to us mating for a year. Can you be quiet? I got earplugs over there. There you go. Perfect. I'm always quiet. You always yell at me for being quiet. <laughs> Would you rather be Cinderella's jerk of a stepsister or be the mirror who has to listen to that ridiculously vain evil queen from Snow White? I want to be Drizella. I think that's her name. Drizella? I want to be one of the evil stepsisters. Yeah, I want to be one of the evil stepsisters. Sorry, Cinderella. Yeah. I feel bad. I never get to be evil. Yeah. I want to be evil. Well, it's not even being evil. It's just being her uh, damn I mean, thing. Oh, I mean the no. evil stepsister. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're yeah. bad. Sorry, I was like, They're mean. <laughs> Hi, Giz. Do you want to sniff my foot? It's a delicious foot. It smells better than me. <laughs> Would you rather be able to eat whatever you want without gaining weight, but food tastes like garbage? Yeah. Or food tastes delicious, but each bite adds an ounce to your weight? I want the food to taste like garbage. Really? Because then I don't so want to have, have to, to lose eat. weight. Because I really like food. Yeah. And if food continues to taste really good, I'm going to eat it. And I'm yeah. literally going to eat until I die. So I want gonna it to taste eat like some garbage. garbage. Yeah. Well, you can probably pick up some garbage with the banging raccoons. <laughs> no, you pick banging raccoons. I'm going to eat garbage with Nickelback. <laughs> uh, well. Can you eat their music? Stop. Why? Turn. <laughs> can we share the, the, the thing? This, song, or this question is for Gizmo. Would you rather listen to Luke Skywalker whining about getting power converters at the Toshi station every morning? I don't even is it get Toshi? That Toshi. I don't Toshi know. Toshi station. Or listen to Jar Jar Binks tell you, oh, moly, moly, I love you every night. That was a terrible Jar Jar impression. That was a terrible, terrible. Jar Jar impression. Gizzard? She owled. She chose neither. That well, sounds like right. She's allowed to do that. I know who Jar Jar Binks is. Mm -hmm. I don't know about, I mean, I know who Luke Skywalker is, but I don't know him. Do you want to hear Luke Skywalker whining or Jar Jar Binks? Which Luke wa Skywalker whining? Young, young Luke Skywalker. Like the, like, child? Or... No, 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 like Mark Hamill. Oh, Mark Hamill? Young Mark Hamill. Oh, him. Like OG Star Wars. Okay, yeah, him. Yeah. I was thinking, like, oh, it's not that's Luke That's not Luke, Skywalker. that's Anakin. That's yeah, Anakin. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, Okay, yeah. that's why I was confused. That's why I was confused. What? Sorry, yeah. yeah. No, because I don't want to listen to him. Yeah. He's a whiny little bitch. They're all whiny little bitch. The whole Skywalker family is whiny little bitches except for Leia, but she's not really a Skywalker, but she's totally a Skywalker. Why? Wait. Never mind. She's Luke's brother, but she's not a Skywalker because she was adopted by Organa. Okay. Uh, would you rather run out of toilet paper after a chili feast? Chili doesn't affect me like that. No, but chili has lots of beans, and mm. I don't put as many beans in because mm. I know you. Or... <laughs> <laughs> I kind or, of feel like I should be offended. Or get caught by your secret crush for not picking up your dog's poop. I don't have a dog. I don't have a secret crush. Okay, basically, do you... This, this is a terrible question. Would you rather get yelled at by somebody for not cleaning up your dog's poop, or would you rather have pooped and run out of toilet paper? Either way, it sounds like I gotta clean up some shit. Yeah, basically. Do you want to clean up your own, or do yeah, you want to clean up a dog's? I'm going to go with the chili. You'd rather clean up your own? Well, if... You're in the toilet after chili with no toilet paper. You just hop in the shower. Okay. Yeah. No judgment. All right. Yeah. Good to know. I'm glad you won't judge me. <laughs> I'm judging you right now. Rude. Totally rude. And those were some sexy noises. <laughs> they there. were something. We have a crash landed uh, gizzard. Yeah, we always have a crash landed gizzard. Oh, oh, stretches. Uh, Are you seeing this? Look at her. She's just like, I'm so tall. She is very tall. Would you rather find out all the Kardashians are Mensa members or find out Einstein plagiarized all his theories and had an IQ of 80? Mensa is the, the, the thing super for really smart people. people. Yeah. So either find out that all of the Kardashians are really intelligent or find out that Einstein had an IQ of 80. And that he plagiarized all of his papers. It Neither would matter to me. Yeah, neither would. I really don't have a preference. No. If he plagiarized all of it, then whoever he stole it from was dumb for not pointing out that they did it. Mm. And if the Kardashians are really smart, good for them. Yeah. I'm glad they're smart. They're not dumb. They play the part of dumb. They kind do. Of, but... Yeah, but I mean, 
Kim went to law school and passed. Like Kim can be a lawyer or is a lawyer. I don't know which. Yeah, there it is. I don't care. Neither one affects my life at all. No, really don't care. Nope. Would you rather have hooks for hands or pegs for legs? Pegs for legs. Pegs for legs? Pegs for legs. Because you need your hands to play drums and uh, um, Yeah, actually, that makes sense. I'll do pegs for legs. Pegs for legs. Would you rather drain the ocean to see what's in there? (laughs) Kind of. I just love how (laughs) that. To see what's in there. Let's just drain it and see what's in there. Let's drain the ocean. Why? Let's see what's in there. Where are you going to put it? Over there. (laughs) Oh. Or bring space closer to see what's (laughs) out there. No, I want to drain the ocean. I want to drain the ocean. I want to drain the ocean. I want to see what's on this planet that we don't know about. Yeah. No, I think that's more exciting than what's out there. Like, yeah. let's find out what's, what's all in there. here yeah. before we go out looking Just for the it. way that shit's worded is That is great. really funny. Drain the ocean to see what's in there or bring space down to see what's out there. No, I would definitely yeah, want to drain the ocean. I'm, a, I'm afraid of what we might find out in space. I'm kind of afraid of what we're going to find in the ocean. Yeah, but once we pull all the water out, it'll go... Bah, 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 bah. <laughs> We'll just be flopping around. That's true. Yeah. Well, then we'll kill them. We'll spritz them. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Because I would be really sad if we killed all the fishes. <laughs> would you rather have your house and all of your belongings encased in lime jello mm. or wake up lost in the Yukon with no phone and no money? What's the Yukon? Is it cold? Okay. That's what I thought. Like snowy winter. Yeah. Yeah. With no phone and no money. Or encased in jello. Jello. Just bring Fat Man over, he'll help. Yeah. Does that mean? You can get out of that with a spoon and, you know, up some time. Yeah, I'm going to go with jello. Yeah. Jello. I, I am too. Because it might be gross, it might be weird, but it's probably not going to kill you. No. Well, I mean, the diabetes will. <laughs> the diabetes. The diabetes. Um, The cold, I mean, it doesn't say you wouldn't have warm clothes. But you're going to have to get out of the cold at some point. And eat. And you're going to have to Food. find somebody that's going to be really nice yeah. and let you, yeah. Jello. It'll just be easier to deal with jello. There's always room for jello. Would you rather be able to hula hoop as your only form of exercise or be able to square dance as your only form of exercise? Hula hoop. I would hula hoop. I'd rather you hula hoop. I had to learn how to square dance in, in school? school. So did I. We are in so, it was so backwater here. Yeah. Yep. There's a whole class about square dancing. That was after you moved up here, wasn't it? It sure was. Yep. 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 Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Square dancing and line dancing. We yep. had to do line dancing mm-hmm. too. I'm like, are you freaking kidding yeah. me? Where did you move me? I was so mad at my parents. I guarantee you are. Yeah. Yeah. I want a hula hoop. Absolutely. I want to watch you hula hoop. I Let's used to be able to hula hoop. I don't think I can whoop, anymore. Whoop, 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 I should get a hula hoop practice. Yes. Would you rather? Only wear clothes you find discarded on the ground, or only wear a large white sheet for the rest of your life. Who's discarding them? Yeah, yeah that's the question. Probably the white sheet. Toke party. Whoop, whoop. Toke party. Whoop, whoop. Toke party. Whoop, whoop. Toke party. Whoop, whoop. Toke party. You just got to take it easy on the star trails. People will think it's a different kind of white sheet party. Whoa. No, we didn't choose to wear that on the plane. No, we didn't. Again, kind Bad. of a, again, kind of a backwater area we're living That's in. That's true. Next question. You're like, hey, how are nope, you doing? Nope, nope. Next question. We're not doing this. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh. Would you rather have fingers made of actual chicken or have ears made of actual corn? Okay, chicken like cluck clucks, uh, or like chicken I'm tenders. Chicken fingers. Oh. Chicken fingers and ears of corn. Let me touch you with my chicken fingers. Let me touch you with my yummy, yummy chicken fingers. (laughs) Let me gnaw on your ears. Whoa. I'm probably going to go with chicken fingers. I would smother you in butter. You would be so delicious. If you eat your chicken fingers. Do they grow back? Do they grow back and then you get more? Oh, you'd never be hungry again. You'd never be hungry, but you get sick of chicken fingers real quick. I would dip them in hot sauce. They would be so delicious. Mm -hmm. If you were a hot dog, (laughs) would you eat yourself? (laughs) I would. I would be delicious. Would you rather have a free phone plan with unlimited data, but only be able to call five people? I think we did this one before, too. Yeah, that sounds familiar. Yeah, we did. Someone got the old discharge. Dis- no, discard pile. Whoa. Whoa. Would you rather lose your wedding ring down a public toilet? I don't have a wedding ring. 
or lose your spouse at a Guns N' Roses concert. Uh, I'm going to lose my wedding ring. I was going to say, do you really want to lose me at a Guns N' Roses nope. concert? You'll run off with Axel. Mm. No, oh, I would go with Slash. My pants are not tight enough for that. Would you rather... What? <laughs> okay, no, this is... Okay, this is weird. Would you rather an unlimited phone plan with endless data and perfect reception, but the phone is a brick from the 80s, or unlimited streaming of all TV and movies, but your computer has dial-up? The brick. I'm thinking the brick, too. It says endless data, but doesn't say there's going to be a, like, 80... Well, 80s didn't really have data plan, but still, yeah. You know, I was just thinking... I don't know if it was last night or this morning. I was thinking... I was remembering my one phone. You've seen that old, old, old Motorola that I had? Mm -hmm. The flip phone mm -hmm. that has the built-in pocket clip on the mm -hmm. back? I fucking love that thing. Yeah. Why don't they have fucking clips on them anymore? You ain't clipping the shit. Why? Because they're the size of novels now. Yeah. Because people figured out they could watch porn on them. So they're like, make the screen bigger. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going with the brick phone. I'll just throw it in my fanny pack and head on down the road. Is it my turn? Yes. Would you rather destroy the internet and end all wars or fight in a war to defend the internet? If we destroy the internet and end all wars... Can we rebuild wars from there? I mean, rebuild the internet from there? Um, we're destroying the internet. No, you're destroying it. We're destroying the internet. Yeah, we're destroying the mm -hmm. internet. Yep, yep, yep. 100%. Yep. The world might be a better place. It probably would be. Because then there'd be no wars, at least. Well, I <laughs> mean, then... they had wars before the internet. No, but you're ending them all. That's part of it. Yeah. Would you rather have webbed hands or always wear toe shoes? Wait, would I rather have webbed hands? Webbed hands. Or always wear toe shoes. I want webbed hands. Really? Yeah. I want toe shoes. Toe shoes aren't comfy. No, but neither would webbed hands. Webbed I hands use my would hands be real stuff. fun. You could still use your fingers. They're only webbed to like here. Web, it doesn't go the whole way up. Mm, depends on how stretched. No, I'm not going to risk it. I'm going with toe shoes. Okay. Well, I don't play an instrument, so. Would you rather have your armpit double as the office stapler? Hmm. Or your mouth double as the office paper shredder. Mm, no, I'm going to. I'm going to do. I'm going to staple some pits. Mm -hmm. The pitzler? No, that doesn't work. Staple it. Staple it. Staple it. Staple pit. Staple it. Okay. Staple it. Give me your used ones, please. I'm going to put them away. Uh, Why? Used. Why, Why do what? you have to make that? <laughs> Why? Uh, 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 oh, my God. <laughs> Would you rather have definitive proof that Bigfoot is real mm. or have definitive proof that ghosts are fake? Ghosts are fake. Ghosts are fake. That is what I would go with, too, because we know Bigfoot is real. He's just blurry. Okay, so she stretched and touched my leg and, like, pet my leg, and I thought it was really cute, so I thought that was, like, a hint to, hey, pet me. Mm -mm. So I reached down and pet her, and she liked it, liked it, and then... <laughs> Yep, that's what she does. But it wasn't like a mean bite. No, it was just a, it a gizzard. It was just like a, a gizzard yeah, nip. it was a gizzard nip. Whoa. Would you rather? <laughs> I'm excited. I don't know if we've done this one before, but if we did, I don't think it was in like the last episode. It was just the one time we played. Would you rather transform into a flying piglet whenever you get upset? Oh. Or an inflatable arm-waving balloon man whenever you get aroused? Oh, oh. <laughs> I am so doing the inflatable arm man. I'm, Does... do... <laughs> I'm doing the piglet. I want to be a flying piglet. For those playing at home, I am waving my arm in front of my crotch like an inflatable arm man's arm. So you can just go ahead and picture that. <laughs> You're welcome. I'm totally, totally inflatable arm man in the bedroom. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh what? imagine being like out in public and just randomly aroused. Like you're like, hey. You know I would do that on purpose. You absolutely would. <laughs> you're like, like, hey. Do you know what I'm going to do to in you when we Target. get home? <laughs> and all of a sudden you just start waiting. Send it all over. you have any room for dessert? Wait, you get aroused from the dessert? No, you'll be like. Oh, <laughs> I thought she well, mentions dessert and you're like, woo. Maybe. Depends on the dessert. Tiramisu. Oh, he's waving. <laughs> yeah, I could have fun with that. That would be great. Maybe I want to do that too. Yeah. I don't get aroused. <laughs> that face. <laughs> that arouses me. <laughs> the face of disappointment. <laughs> well. Huh. 
Would you rather know the date you'll get struck by lightning or know the date you'll get dumped by the love of your life? Are you going to dump me? No. All right, then I want to know when I'm going to get struck by lightning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See, that yeah. was pretty clever. Yeah, that was pretty clever. Would you rather play Monopoly and actually walk away with the properties that you buy or play the game of life and actually walk away with the family that you put together? Properties. Yep. Properties. <laughs> that was like properties. Properties. Puppies. Puppies. <laughs> puppies. Properties and puppies. Puppies and properties. Properties for my puppies. Mm. Would you rather never be able to trust your best friend mm. or never be able to trust your farts? Oh, that makes you way too happy. I'm in my 40s. I already don't trust my farts. Oh, is that what I have to look forward to? You're, we're here. I'm not at 40 yet. Oh, sure. no, you're a girl. Girls don't fart. No, we don't poop and we don't fart. So I thought you meant you're looking forward to mine. Yeah. I'm going to take that. Yeah. I, I don't trust your farts. I don't trust my farts at all. They're sketchy. Would you rather be stuck in a pool with a shark and only a pool noodle to defend yourself or be in a plane when the pilot dies and you have to land it by using only what you've learned in movies? My brain immediately goes to airplane. Mine too. So we're going to land that plane. Heck yeah. Although, I don't know. I would kind of like to hit a shark with a pool noodle. Boom, 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 boom. I try to like jam it down the gullet. That might work. I'm going to fight the shark with a pool noodle. All right. I'll land the plane. In you the land the plane in the pool and take out the shark if yes. I can't do it. Teamwork. Would you rather know how every magic trick works or know only one magic trick, but you're the world's best at doing it? So I am really bad at not knowing things. Like it it drives me crazy. That's why I like look up the endings to shows before we watched it. So I want to know how all of them work, but then I'll just be disappointed because it won't be magical anymore. But yeah. Did yeah. that annoy you? That just sounds like farts. Oh. <laughs> I'm shuffling the cards. <laughs> I'm not farting. I don't fart. Rude. Was that your fart? No, you're shuffling were the cards. Were you? No, I wasn't. You were <laughs> farting. <laughs> I love us. <laughs> Ooh, here's a good one for you. I don't care either way. Would you rather travel through Europe with James Bond... Or travel the outer rim with Han Solo. Han Solo. I thought me. Yeah. I was never really super huge into Bond. Yeah, for some reason I read it, but in my brain I was thinking Indiana Jones. Yeah, Indiana Jones, that would be... that'd be. Okay, so I'm changing it. Indiana Jones or Han Solo? Which Harrison Ford do I want to hang out with? <laughs> That's why I really... Like, my brain went to that. Yeah. Han Solo. I would pick Indy. Indy seems like a lot of running and physical stuff. He rides horses. <laughs> I rode a horse once and it hurt really bad for like three days. Oh. I don't like it. So you want to go up in space? Yeah, there's fewer horses. And I'd assume. I don't know. <laughs> we'll go to Alfie Centauri and find out they're all horses. I don't even know the words you're speaking, so go ahead. Would you rather have a wasp in the car while you're driving Ooh. or have a spider climb in your mouth while you're sleeping? B. I remember me one time... Years and years and years ago, we were driving down the road. My dad, this is years and years and years ago. Dad was driving. Parents still together years ago. He was driving down the road and he had his arm out the window because it was summer, obviously. He was wearing a short sleeve shirt mm -hmm. and a wasp went up his sleeve. He starts, ah, pulls over really quick. And he jumps out, tearing his shirt off. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on? It nailed him like I bet. half a dozen times all over the place. Yeah, it went right up his sleeve. Oh, that's awful. Yeah. I'm going to have a spider climb in my mouth. I'm sleeping. I don't know about it. That's true. Yeah. And they say you eat. They say it. Eat. That's, that, that's, that's, I'm pretty sure that's a bullshit statistic. Okay. But as disgusting yeah, as asleep. it is, I'm going to do spider also, as long as it's not a really big one. Yeah. Spider in my mouth. Like, I don't want a tarantula crawling Well, no, not a tarantula. Just a little guy. Yeah. Even no, a medium sized guy. Yeah. All right. As long as I'm sleeping. Yeah. I don't know about it. All right. Is this the last one? That was three. All right. So I have to ask one and then we're done? Sure. Because you started. Yeah. Would you rather control monkeys as long as one of them is always throwing their poop at you or control dogs as long as one is always humping your leg? Dogs. I was going to say, how often do you see monkeys? Yeah, it'd be way easier just ha just stick your leg out, have the dog do his thing, and then point your herd, mm -hmm. flock. Gullet. Gullet. It's not gullet. <laughs> I don't, a, a gaggle, gaggle a of dogs. Gaggle, gaggle of dogs. A school of dogs. <laughs> What? A business of dogs. A business. A business, a business of, dogs. of dogs, yes. 
but point them and send them where? Wherever. To hump other people's legs. Oh. That's not what I'm taking. If I must have a dog hump my leg, everyone must. Go! Go! Run free and hump! Hump away! Hump to your heart's content. Well. Well, indeed. On that note, (laughs) thanks for hanging out and playing with us tonight. We hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. It was a good time. It was a good time. This time we're going to try to... to um... I already have it figured out. All right. She's got it all figured out. She's organized one. I have I'll it just figured out. Uh-huh. I'm organized. And we are talking with kitties. Now we're going to be sleeping with kitties because it's, it's almost our bedtime. It is almost our bedtime. This was a game night that was actually recorded at night. Yeah. So Yay. thanks for hanging out this evening with us. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs> I hope we don't get sued for that. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I'll be fine. You can't get sued for... Well, on that special note... (laughs) We will get sued for that one. I didn't say it the way he says it. Oh. On that disappointing note, or disappointing... And on that incredible disappointment... Yes. Yes. And on that incredible disappointment, this was the... We're out. Yep. Bye. Bye. (laughs) Bye.